Hey guys and welcome back to Best Car Picks. Renault has a new flagship, Rafael, and despite its positioning as a midsize SUV, it departs from tradition enough that it's clear the brand isn't chasing volume, instead, it's going more premium. The Renault Rafale, which derives its name from the Cadran C.430 Rafale, a two-seat plane built under Renault's aviation subsidiary that set a speed record of 292 km per hour soon after its first flight, is not only the French brand's new flagship, but also a model very important to its overall lineup. Renault CEO Fabrice Campbellive said the Rafale is a central piece to the brand's strategy, which it calls the Renault-lution, a portmanteau of Renault Revolution, and that it symbolizes move-up market. Unlike its namesake, the Rafale SUV won't be setting any speed records as it debuts with a single front-wheel drive option for now, a hybridized and turbocharged 1.2-liter four-cylinder engine making 147 kilowatts and employing a pair of electric motors, powered by a small 2 kWh battery. One motor fits between the engine and gearbox for starting the engine and acting as a clutch, while the other helps drive the front wheels from the axle. Renault says it'll later be joined by a more powerful all-wheel drive e-tech version, with 220 kilowatts and a bigger battery. The Rafale features a new styling direction for the brand, something which the brand says helps establish it as a status symbol coupe SUV, thanks to its raked back and sharp lines. Elements like its new light pattern and its diamond-themed gloss black grille are highlights. The design is so important to the brand that it's the most prominent part of its official media communications about the Rafale, coming before the interior features and drivetrain are even mentioned. It's not confirmed which global markets will receive the Rafale, though Renault says it'll launch around Q2, 2024 for the Northern Hemisphere spring. Hope you enjoyed the video. Do subscribe for more such interesting content. Thank you for watching my video.